Oh crap. I don't think you were meant to see this. <laughs> Most of us have been living under lockdown for the last few months. Gyms and sports centers have been shut for the most part. And if you're anything like me, you've probably been dealing with all the stress by overindulging in foods that you probably shouldn't be consuming. As a result, most of us have seen our waistlines balloon beyond our wildest dreams. And now that the lockdowns are finally being lifted, many of us are looking to lose some of the weight that we've gained in the last couple of months. But weight loss doesn't come without risks. Many people who've lost weight in the past have found that fat isn't the only thing that they tend to lose. They also lose valuable muscle mass. Stay tuned to find out what the science tells us about preserving muscle mass while losing weight. And make sure you hit that subscribe button to keep tabs on all the great medical content I publish each and every week. Sarcopenia is a condition characterized by low muscle mass and reduced muscle function. It's important to try to preserve muscle mass when losing weight as you don't want to compromise on any of the potential health benefits of losing weight. It's a well-known fact that 20 to 30% of the weight that an overweight person will lose will be lean muscle mass. This number goes up significantly to over 35% if the person is of normal weight. If you ask me, these are pretty significant numbers. So the research tells us that the best way to prevent the loss of muscle mass while losing weight is to engage in resistance or endurance type exercise. Think cycling or maybe weightlifting. In fact, one study found that the loss of thigh muscle mass was reduced by half when study subjects engaged in 5 hours or more of aerobic exercise per week. In fact, when study subjects reduced their intake of food alone without engaging in resistance or endurance type exercise, they were found to lose 70% more muscle mass than study subjects who engaged in exercise and also reduced their intake of calories. Increasing the intake of protein was found to play a significant yet smaller role in preserving muscle mass during weight loss. Research scientists were able to reduce the loss of muscle mass by providing up to 1.5 times the recommended daily intake of protein. Supplementation with fish oils, vitamin D and leucine were also found to be beneficial. So why is it so important to preserve muscle mass? Why did I decide to make an entire video about it? Muscle strength and power are important independent predictors of general health as well as the risk for negative outcomes. Having reduced muscle mass puts you at an increased risk for falls, hip fractures, and even increases your risk for mortality. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then I would really appreciate it if you could tell YouTube that. You could do that by pressing the like button right now. You can also subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with all the great medical content I publish each and every week. Until next week then.